Hey everyone, this is Mr. Mannion covering geometry. Identify parallel, intersecting, and skew lines and planes. In geometry, there's a lot of new vocabulary that you're learning, and one of those is skew lines. Now, skew lines are lines that are not in the same plane and do not intersect. Here's how that's going to work. I'll show you the answer choices. Not there. Here we go. And here we go. All right. J GK and JN. I'm going to highlight those. GK is here. And JN is here. So notice that both of those lines are on the same face of the cube. Since they're on the same face, they're on the same plane... And that means these definitely can't be skew lines since they're on the same plane. Second of all, I actually know these lines are parallel. They're in the same plane and they're never going to touch. So they're parallel. So answer A or the first one is L. Let me try the next one. It says HI and LM. Again, notice that those two lines are on the same plane and they're parallel. So that means that these are not skew. So following the same reasoning from last time. GJ and KN. GJ, KN. The exact same reasoning. They're on the same face, they're parallel, which means that those can't be skew. So, just so happens that the last one's got to be our answer, and here, let's see why. It says I M and G H. So, I M and G H. Here we go. That's a really good example of skew lines. They are not on the same face of the cube. They're not in the same plane, is what I'm saying. And they're not parallel. Like, they're never going to touch, but they're not in the same plane, which makes them skew instead of being parallel. So, I'm going to select this last choice as my answer. In this triangular prism, which ones are skew? So, I am quickly going to go through this one and hopefully come to the same reasoning as last time. Let's see, JK and KL. So JK and KL. You see that those lines are actually intersecting and they're in the same plane. So first one's out. KL and GH. Now that looks great. They're not in the same plane and they do not intersect. So I'm pretty sure that's going to be my answer. Let me double check. GJ, IL, nope, those are parallel, IL, and KL. So while those are not in the same plane, they are intersecting, which means that those aren't skew. So that's why that one's incorrect as well. So we're left with the second choice. All right, let's go ahead. Which lines are intersecting? I'm pretty sure you can get those. In this square pyramid, which ones are skew? I'm going to go ahead and skip that one. Or actually, I'm going to do it real quick. KL and KO. Nope. LM and KO. Yes. Which lines are parallel? So select all that apply. So parallel lines must be in the same plane. Let me try K-O-L-P, K-O-L-P, that looks promising, I'm going to select that one, J-K-L-M, J-K-L-M, same plane, they're never going to touch, yes, those are parallel, P-Q-L-M, same plane, never going to touch, yes. And 
Simmons, LP, MQ. LP, MQ. Same plane, never gonna touch. All four were examples of parallel lines. One, two, three, four. Select. Why aren't you working? There we go, submit. Well done. Everybody, which planes? Okay, this time, planes are parallel. So, we're gonna try FHI, FH to I. So, I'm selecting this entire plane and FGH. I'm gonna use a different color. F to G to H. Okay, so when think of this as like a slice of a pie. I'm thinking about food here. Maybe I'm a fatty. I don't know. But think of this as a slice of pie. The red is the top of the pie. The blue is the side of the pie. Now, those two planes, are they parallel? Will those planes never touch? The answer is no. Those planes are actually intersecting each other. So, this one is out. Let me try FGI. Whoops, I need to get rid of that blue. FGI. Which is this side of the pie. And FHI. FHI. These two, so both sides of the pie, as they're coming in, both sides of the pie, they're intersecting right here. So that means that they are not parallel. So that one's up. FGH, top of the pie, and IJK, bottom of the pie. Do the top of the pie and the bottom of the pie, do they intersect? No, those two are parallel to each other. So we finally found one of our answers. That's great. GHJ. Here we go. GHJ. And FGH. F to G to H. So we have the back of the pie and the top of the pie. Those do intersect, and we can see them intersecting right up here where I'm highlighting in green. That's where those two planes intersect. So the only answer choice that we have is going to be the third one. Brilliant. Let's keep going. Which lines are intersecting? Um, I'll do this one because we haven't seen this type of example. DF and EF. So DF. EF. Do those intersect? Yes, they do. So, C, D, E, F. Are those intersecting? No. C, D, D, F. Do those lines touch? Do they intersect? Yes. And last, C, E, D, E. Yes. So, I have three answer choices to pick. One, two, and three. Excellent. Everybody, I am, I can't jump a level. So, uh, I am going to leave it here. Actually, you know what, let me go through these real quick, just to make sure there's not going to be a pop-up question that we, I haven't talked about. Which lines are intersecting? S-T-U-Y? No. U-Y? W-X? No. S-T-T-X? Yes? STVW? No. Intersecting? Yes. No. 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 Which planes intersect? So, another pie question. Everybody, I am going to leave it here. It looks like they're going to keep on repeating the same types of questions to make sure that you get it down. Again, this was parallel intersecting skew lines and planes that you'll be working with next year in geometry. Everybody, this is Mr. Mannion. I hope you have a great day.